What's up, Tribe Squad? It's your girl, Chandelay. Welcome back to my channel, girl. Yes, welcome back to Shandism 101, where I tell you everything you need to know about a wig before you order her online, girl. Today, we're going to be talking about Bobby Boss Miss Kiva, so hope you sit back, relax, and like this video. Alright guys, so today's video is a collaboration with Miss Ebony V. I love her channel. We are doing hashtag bold color series. She came up with this really cool idea to combine bold colors and bold lip colors and makeup looks. And instead of just doing some random collab, we actually worked together um, to think about what we wanted to do for this collaboration. So I am bringing you Kiva from Bobby Boss in the color, um, I don't know, maybe it's Periwinkle? I don't know, it's some type of blue. We're gonna be talking about bold colorful wigs and she is just bringing you an entire series. So you'll wanna make sure you head over to her channel and tell her Shandy sent you and make sure you show a little love in her comment section. Cause I got high hopes. Wow. I also wanna pluck just a few of these hairs. Nothing too crazy, I'm just gonna go through and try to pull out some of these. So much easier to do when I didn't have nails. I'm over here like a T-Rex. To... All right guys, so I'm not wearing this wig with any glue at all. It's completely like not glued down whatsoever. I'm wearing it glueless because this is how the wig states that you can wear it. I did go in with a little heat to the top. Um, I pressed out this section after I went ahead and picked out some of the hairline to break that up because I felt like it was just like round, bitch. It was just like really round. Um, I did that and broke it up a little bit and I tinted this lace. All that being said, it took me a month to review this wig because I knew off top that this wig was going to take a lot of work. and. Honestly, I don't like doing that. So, <laughs> girl. So you'll just wanna keep that in mind if you order this wig because she's a lot of work. However, this wig is cute, girl. Like, it pays sometimes to do the work because I know that this wig had potential and I just kept looking at her and bitch, I was just like, okay, okay, we're gonna play this game. But now I'm looking at it and it just looks so cute. It just, it really does. Hold on, what is this little hair doing? You need to get in line, sir. And um, we're gonna cut this off. I'll be right back. It's in the color T4 Sapphire. Oh girl, this is cute. And I paired her with this really cute lip. For our collaboration, I agreed to do the bold wig color with a bold lip color, girl. I like dramatic extraness, so you know me. I like to be extra. So I decided to pair my sapphire wig with this really cute pink color from Fenty that is perfect for summer because it is just like hot pink, honey. It is like, yes, 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 yes. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Girl, why not? It's summer. We're allowed to go back outside at your own risk. And obviously, thank you so much, Miss Ebony V, for collaborating with you, girl. I appreciate you, sis, and all of the support and kindness you have shown to me since I've started my journey. But not just on YouTube, as a friend, you have been here for me for some difficult times, and I've told you about it. And I just really appreciate you. So make sure once you're done watching my video, you guys go check her out. I will link her down below. I'm not going to necessarily show you the install because my install method is the same. 
I have a very detailed install method that is literally step by step and I will link it down below. It is how I handle all Bobbi Boss glueless wigs. Whew, honey, because sometimes these wigs, they're a beast. I don't necessarily recommend these wigs for beginners. I don't think that these are beginner friendly wigs. These are advanced wigs bitch these is wigs that's gonna take some experience it's gonna take a little time you gotta put in some work sometimes on some of these wigs honey and i'm trying to tell you so make sure you guys check out that video this wig is so cute but i did not like this wig at all oh my god the first time i got this wig and i tried it on girl i wanted to cry it just looked so left it really did it looked so off i'm gonna show you guys the footage it just didn't look right. The lace wasn't blended. The, the baby hairs wasn't looking right. The natural plucked hairline does take that amount of time, but it's worth it. As you can see, this wig looks good. It's a free parting space bob, bitch. That's perfect for summer, but I didn't want to do all that work. I'm lazy. I don't like to do all that work. I want to do it. It was too much. That's my biggest con. Glad it came together because I really like this wig and I like that I could um, put it up as well. Like, I think that that is so cute. Oh my God. I, I do, I really, really like that. Cause you can put this wig up and wear it in different styles, but I'm not going to. Now, girl, I really like this wig. I am wearing this wig with zero glue. I don't have any glue on, this is I could rip it off right now, girl. There's no glue on this wig. That's how laid she is. I love that. Um, I am using the adjustable band in the back. I thought that that was originally pointless, but it ended up serving a purpose. Flat, flat, flat. It is completely, here, let me show you guys that it is glueless, that I don't have any spray, got to be spray, any type of adhesive. It's just like, this is all just underneath there. I'll show you guys again. Yeah, so that looks good. Um, con for me, right here, I got my little edges out. Um, and you can pull a little hair forward and maybe put a little glue and then you're in this game and it's a natural situation. But I just hate how Bobby Boss does that. Like, because I'm a girl who wears glasses and I can't wear glasses with wigs like this. It's hard to wear glasses that if I if I glue this wig down, I can't get the wig where it needs to sit so that I can still wear glasses and see, bitch. You know, shit. But yeah, that's Bobby Boss. Overall, this is what the wig looks like. She's cute. Tangling, minimal, shedding is, um, um, I'm getting some shed hairs. Not a lot, though. I mean, as you can see, I think really after I kind of get some of the hair that I've cut and stuff out of it, I'm not going to really have any shedding. I like the movement of this wig and I like the density of it. It's a thick wig. Girl, I love a thick bob. Um, the last bob I reviewed, Miss Ava from Janet Collection, she had something weird going on in the back. I didn't like that. This one does not. It's like, it's hair all around, girl. It's this thick city. But also... It does have extended lace, so it is big head friendly because it's got a lot more space in the back. But it's also not big head friendly from a, a standpoint up here because you will have your edges out. That's on anyone. It's not because your head size is larger than others. It's because they didn't make this wig right. That's what it is, just so you know. Overall, overall, she came out nice. She came out cute. She really pulled her shit together. Um, So... Yeah, um, price point wise, you know they're hitting over the head for this one, so you will want to plan ahead before you go ahead and splurge on this unit, girl. I'll link the information on where you can order down below if you want to get you some Tribe Squad merch. Go ahead and check out my link down below. It just supports me on my YouTube journey, so I would really appreciate it. If you haven't already, make sure you give this video a thumbs up and let me know that you like it in the comments. That's where we get the conversation popping. And subscribe to my Tribe Squad. Hopefully you like this video and you want to see more of me on your timeline. Um, so make sure you subscribe and turn your notifications on so you never miss an upload because you know YouTube be playing. And uh, I will see you guys next time. Bye, guys. All right, guys. So before I go... <clears throat>
All right, guys, before I go, I wanted to show you guys how I ended up styling this wig because she's so cute, girl. Um, This is just a little bonus footage. She's just got this cute little, like, bop up here. And I just pulled some of it up, and, like, it's still completely glueless. Like, it's not glued down. And it just looks so cute. So I wanted to show you guys that if you did want to pull this wig up, that she would look really good pulled up. Also, I wanted to show you what she looks like in the natural light just so you can see that i mean she installed really well um the cap is coming across still a little brighter than i'd like so i could go in with some um concealer but i'm not i'm gonna just let it do what it's doing because it's cute she is cute all right guys that's all i had that was the last oh whoo girl hold on that was a lot of hair. Okay, anyways, that's all I had. I hope you guys liked this video. Um, if you did, let me pull that down a little bit. All right, anyways, that's all I had, you guys. If you guys liked this video, please let me know in the comment section down below, and I will see you guys next time. Bye, guys. Thanks for watching.